Hi everyone and welcome to Triple M Adventures with Bill. This is episode three of series one of the Jumper T16 screens. We're going to be going through the page which is Global Functions and the page which is Trainer. Right, let's take a look at the Trainer and Global Functions menus in our Jumper T16. Right, with the System menu button and we click Page until we get to the first one. Now the global functions is exactly what it says. If you want to set up a function that operates for any of your models, then you would put that function in here. Now the only function I have is set up on my radio is the volume. So I can use S2, you won't be able to see this, but I can change the volume of the callouts of the radio when it starts talking to me. There are probably quite a few global functions you could put on there, but at the moment I just have that one. So that is what the global functions page is. And the trainer page. Now this is where we can set up our buddy box system so that we can help someone learn to fly. Now, I haven't set this system up, but you can change the channel order if you need to, if it doesn't um, match up to the radio that you're connecting to. And then there's a, the multiplier. This allows you to adjust that setting. If when you see the person you're training move their sticks full deflection and it doesn't show a correct reading in the calibration down here. So you would be able to change that multiplier so it does. So it gives, it gives the person learning to fly full throws. And then this section is to, you can actually perform a calibration. And that's it for those screens. That's everything that you should know about those particular screens. Disarm motor. 